welcome, welcome, welcome. It's going to be for Gemini. For some reason, I already split the deck, but it wanted me to do it again. So, Gemini. Third week in July 2021. Gemini, staying alive, staying alive. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Staying alive. Staying alive. All right, Gemini. My little gummy bears. Week 3, July 2021. Gemini. Ooh. Here comes the sun. You might be dealing with a Leo, um, but your past wants back. There's something over and something new. Someone must have been a Girl Scout or a Boy Scout. Something silver, something blue. Is that a wedding thing? That's a Girl Scout thing too. Because it's keep, keep, keep new, keep both. Certain old friends have old friends and keep their new one is silver and the other is gold. Make new friends, something like that. So, and that's <laughs> three of cups, it's friends. So, I don't know if you're a Girl Scout, someone's a Boy Scout, I don't know. <laughs> oh my goodness. I don't know who that message is for. But, and this is your past wanting to circle back around. You felt stabbed in the back or you stabbed them in the back, vice versa. They're manifesting a brand new connection, friendship. You could be dating and it's too late. No, well, I can't say it's too late. But they might look at it like it's too late. Could be dealing with a Sag. If you're a Sag, you're dealing with children. I don't see it that way, though. Yeah, somebody wants to come back around and put more effort in. It's like they wanted to be solo or something, yeah. The fool. They went back around. Queen of Swords. Put your God up in the world. That's a finality. So there's some type of ending and a new beginning. So I think there was too many people in the picture. Damn. So this is still an ending. So there had to have been three people in the picture, too many people that was interference, whether it was a lover, a child, a family member, a friend. You know, not everyone's got to be sleeping together. Okay. So there's an ending. There's a finality here with the queen of swords. Somebody's kind of like cold, coming in cold. Okay. Somebody's looks like somebody's past came into the picture or is about to come back around. They want to put more work in at one point. It was like a dolo, but now they want to, I almost said go on a mission. So I don't know what that's about. Take me to the moon. Now they're manifesting. They want to transition into something new. They want to transform. And they're trying to strategize. So there was so many people in the picture. Six of Wands. Somebody moved forward. And the lovers. Shocking. Shocking, not shocking. Okay, so... This is moving away from one lesson learned going towards another. There's two here. This is what I love here. So somebody from your past or current past is now coming back around, wanting to put the effort in, wanting to take a journey with you. Okay, there is something over. Doesn't look like the feminine's too happy about it. You might want to watch Libra or Aquarius, I forget which one. If you guys already watched it, let them know. It's, especially if you watched Patreon. It was more about a karmic scenario with Aquarius. It was Aquarius. So what's going on here? Because that's, that's not you. That's what's over with them. Yeah, boundaries, blockages. But again, same thing. The feminine didn't want to accept it. Okay. And they're coming in as Aquarian. Right now they're coming in as Libra. I believe it was the, f the sun, which was Leo or Taurus, sun, moon, rising, for the one that didn't want to accept something. Okay. So what is this seven of cups what is their next move well right now they're just how do i do this they're strategizing how do i transform 
how do I transform this with that? Ace of Wands. Okay. So the Emperor, they could have been married, but it's just that type of energy. So now somebody from your past. Let's see. With this past person with the Six of Cups, let's see what their energy is right now. You know, they they now want to go on this journey. Okay. But um, I want to see what their energy is. Right, could be dealing with an Aries, changing their perspective. See, because of the death card, something they know they need to transform something. So there was somebody else interfering. That was your major blockage. And I will tell you, this energy is still kind of like, doesn't want to accept it, but it's, it's kind of... It's, it's karmic it just I hate to say it like that but it's just kind of it's too bad you know life goes on um which just pulled me to the wonder years when Winnie and Kevin it, it's like their theme song life goes on I don't I don't know I'm getting a lot of older songs here guys so there was clearly too many people in the picture. This is a lesson learned, and it's, it's choosing one. Now, if you're that one and you're watching or you're cross-watching or this is you choosing, looks like you're making the right choice. But you still, yeah, this thing's going on be behind the scenes. You're still unaware of what's going down. It's their ending with the world. It's, it's almost like they don't want you to know or they're finalizing something, okay? So, yeah, that's that's past Heartache. and and for it to be reversed is it's almost like not even showing it it's like this is like crying over spilt milk like so it could be them they're unaware and there's another energy that's just moving on it's it's gonna be surprise surprise though because this other energy is is going in a new direction yeah, see what the, it's not, they're going to make the decision right here, and then it's like decision made moving forward. Okay, and then you got somebody who's, where it's going to get exposed, and it's like fake pain. You know, so I don't know if somebody was in it for money, the children, other reasons besides love, clearly. Possible outcome for Gemini. We got the chariot, so it's being triumphant, it's moving forward, it's victory. All right, guys, enjoy your week. I will see you on Patreon. Bye.